This is a tutorial for Miss Tempest's uh, Spanish class on how to open up notebook files using Smart Express. Um, so basically, I'm using Firefox, but uh, you could do this with Internet Explorer or Google Chrome. It, it's pretty much the same format. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to Edline and open up the Spanish page. Now you're going to click on no Notebook Files. Now you're going to get a list. This is the seventh grade review activities. That's not us. So you're going to want to go to air travel. And now this is where it might be a bit different for uh, different browsers. Uh, so for or I'm using Firefox. So what you're going to do is you're going to click save file. Um, for Internet Explorer, it's going to look pretty much the same. Um, but no matter what, you have to click save. Do not click open. Um, if you click open, it uh, won't work because there is no... Uh, program that is associated with the notebook file. So you're going to click Save, click OK, and now uh, we're going to go to your desktop. So just click on Desktop, and now I suggest that we make a Spanish folder just so that for in the future it will be a lot more neat and organized. So you're going to click New Folder and Spanish. Now let's double click that and just save this file right in the Spanish folder save. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the Spanish page and we're going to click on under links the Smart Notebook Express. Click on that. Might take a bit of time to open up, but it's okay. Now, here's the mistake that most people do. Um, when you're on your... what most people are doing is when you uh, save it, you try to run it. Now, this will not work because there as I said before there is no f uh, program on your computer that can open this so instead of opening it you're gonna wanna go to this website as we said and click on open an existing notebook file so this is gonna open up a little prompt like this and basically uh, all you're gonna do is you're gonna click desktop and you're gonna go to your Spanish folder and you're gonna click on the file that you want to open now it takes a bit of time to just register and load it, but once it does that, you'll be able to access all the files that we do in class. So as you can see, this is all the smart board stuff that we do. You could study with this. You could do lots of stuff. This has all the slides that we've been doing. Uh, you could pull that over so you could see what the answers are. You could review by yourself. But basically, that's just how you do uh, the notebook files, how do you get them to open. So uh, I hope this was a helpful tutorial and uh, yep, thanks.